to live every day like it's your last and enjoy every moment of it because you never know when something's going to happen. I used to eat, live, breathe, soccer, everything. I played six times a week. I was playing on an academy team and I was supposed to go overseas to England and I was going on a bunch of showcases in the States for some scholarships. And then one day, I was diagnosed with osteosarcoma, the same cancer as Terry Fox. And to hear I couldn't play it again, I was scared because when you're a kid and you think of cancer, you assume cancer ends with death. My whole life changed. When Yusuf went for his first surgery, which they were going to remove the tumor, they explained to us a bunch of complications. Basically what it meant was when Yusuf went in for surgery, he didn't know if when he came out he was going to have a leg, a half leg, or the whole leg was going to be amputated. Or they could salvage his limb. They didn't know. They went into the surgery. It was an extremely long surgery, 16 hours, 18 hours, something like that. And when he woke up, <laughs> got to keep his leg and be who he is today. I'm alive today because of all the research. If this was 20 years ago, I think my chances would be a lot less. I mean, I think they'd be less than 20%, but today it's almost a 98% chance of success rate for my scenario, and that is just absolutely amazing. I think that with all the donations made over the years and the millions raised, I think that We've been able to come to terms with a cure for a lot of cancers, and if not a cure, a very high successful rate. Terry started it, but he's not here today. His legacy is alive, and I think that the key is the one man who started it all, but us as a country have been like, contributing so much to Terry Fox Friends, you know. It's other people that are saying, hey, we can make a difference, let's make a difference. I played my whole entire life soccer, 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 soccer. And then the minute I was diagnosed, I realized I haven't experienced life. You know, I haven't got a chance to go skydiving, I haven't got a chance to do bungee jumping, I haven't got a chance to do all the things I want to do that are for say on my bucket list. And now I realize that if I had the chance to play soccer as much as I did before, I don't think I would. To all the students who are still on the edge about taking part in the Terry Fox run this year, I want you to know that everyone can make a difference and every little bit helps. Whether it's a donation, whether it's you running, you're always helping a good cause and you're donating to cancer research, which is absolutely amazing and will help each and every one of you one day.